All right, well, here's a short video on the Nuke Alert, which is a small Geiger counter. It's got a battery in it that will uh, keep it going for 10 years, they say. 24-7 radiation monitor and alarm. So, one of the good things about it is it auto-calibrates. It's got a little, uh, uh, I'm sure it won't be able to hear it. I'm going to put it up to the microphone just to see if it actually comes through. Yeah, maybe you heard those little ticks. It ticks, 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 and uh, somehow that calibrates it. Got a little uh, thing on the back, kind of shows you uh, if you're getting uh, this amount of radiation for that many hours. Uh, number of chirps, sorry. Starts out with a number of chirps. One chirp is 0.01 R per hour, which is rad or rem or uh, R is the designation. Time to 100 uh, rems would be 41 days. So if it's clicking once, you're getting that much radiation per hour. It takes you 41 days to accumulate 100 rads. And that's because radiation is cumulative. So you're only supposed to get like 25 uh, rads in your lifetime. And uh, so even getting uh, like up here, four clicks, you're getting almost uh, one rad or rim per hour. And then it accumulates in 5.2 day, days, you've accumulated 100 rads, which is really bad. So that kind of gives you an idea. So it starts, the lowest reading is about 0.1, as you see, and then 10 plus clicks. So some point it goes off, I'm going to take it to, uh, they say you can take it to like a dentist's office and get it in front of a uh, an x-ray machine and then it'll set, that'll set it off, but as you see you can put on your keychain, they're about 175 bucks or so on eBay, you can get some better deals on occasion, somebody have two on there or something, that's why I got two for uh, 165 I think, plus shipping. Neat little machines. Everybody should have one these days. All right.